Welcome my dear friends. In this video, we are going to fix an error that says element not found when trying to fix Windows boot issues. We already have a nice detailed videos in our channel on how to fix boot issues. In those videos, users have reported that they get element not found error, especially when they try to run bootrec fix boot command. So we have decided to add this video. Little understanding of MBR and GPT is required here. These are basically partition styles. At high level, MBR is the old method and GPT is the new advanced partition method. And another major difference that's more related to our problem. The system partition of MBR is NTFS file system, it can be a separate volume or in some installations it could be the same volume where Windows is installed. As far as GPT is concerned, it is strictly FAT32 file system, and it should be a separate volume away from Windows volume. In case of MBR, the firmware looks for BCD store in the active partition. In contrast, active partition concept is not applicable in GPT. So identifying your partition style is the first very important step. Get into disk part. List disk. If you see star symbol over here then your disk is GPT. If you don't see a star then you have MBR disk. Based on this we can confirm that this PC has MBR disk. Now the second very important step is to identify your system volume. As we seen already in MBR, your system volume can either be a separate volume or the same volume where your Windows is installed. Let's go ahead and list volume. Over here, please check if you have a separate system partition volume. If you do not have, maybe your Windows partition is the system partition. Once you finalize your system partition, you should now ensure that the same has been set as active partition. Please select the volume that you believe is system partition. Use detail partition command. Over here you should see active yes. If you do not see, then please set it as active. You just need to type active and hit enter. Please exit disk part. We are all set. Let's go ahead and try the boot rec fix boot command. In case you see access denied, please try this boot sect command that you see on screen. Now your boot rec fix boot should complete successfully. For some of you this is not the end. If your issue is not resolved, or if you have GPT disk, or if you face any other boot issues, please follow the video links provided in the description below. I hope this video helped you. If you face any questions or challenges, please add your comments below, I'll definitely respond to you. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done already. Thank you so much for watching.